Cleaning a school bus with a Kyvac no-touch cleaning system is a quick and easy process, so let's get started. Before we begin, ensure that you're utilizing the proper personal protective equipment, including eye protection, gloves, and slip-resistant footwear. To begin, wheel the system to the front door of the bus, turn on the pump, and turn the chemical selector valve to the on position. Now, unwrap the pressure hose and walk to the rear of the bus, laying the hose on the floor as you walk. Beginning at the rear of the bus, apply cleaning solution to the floor and under the seats, working from the rear of the bus to the front. When you reach the bus steps, return to the machine and turn the chemical selector valve to the off position. Then, apply cleaning solution to the steps, making use of the chemicals still on the pressure hose. Once the chemical has been applied to the floor and it's had the appropriate dwell time, we'll pressure rinse areas of the bus floor where dirt and debris collect. Work your way from the rear of the bus to the front, focusing on problem areas like seat attachment points. It's not necessary to blast rinse the entire floor. When you reach the steps, blast rinse from the top of the steps to avoid splashback. When the steps have been rinsed, turn off the pump and wrap the pressure hose back onto the system. Next, attach a 10 inch or a 14 and a half inch squeegee head to the vacuum hose and turn on the vacuum. Use the squeegee head to vacuum the bus steps. The squeegee head can also be used to remove water from the door glass. Now, connect the vacuum wand to the vacuum hose and remove water from the bus floor. Begin at the front of the bus and vacuum your way to the rear of the bus, recovering cleaning solution from the floor as you go. Kyvet's vacuum wand is designed to maneuver into tight spaces, like underneath school bus seats. The vacuum process leaves the floor clean and dry, ready for immediate use. Once the floor has been vacuumed, return to the system and disconnect the vacuum wand from the hose. Then, wrap the hose back onto the machine, leaving the vacuum running to avoid dripping solution from the end of the hose. When the hose has been wrapped, turn off the vacuum motor. Now that the bus floor has been cleaned, you may proceed to the next bus and repeat the process. If you are finished with your cleaning task, it's time to empty the system. Please refer to the Emptying and Rinsing the System video module for detailed instructions.